The Bonisson Exhibition is the first important solo show of Bernard Aubertin since his death in 2015. Bonisson Art Center is a private art center located in Rogne near Aix-en-Provence in the south of France. You know that it would be untrue You know that I would be a liar If I was to say to you Girl, we couldn't get much higher Come on, baby, like my fire Come on, baby, like my fire Tonight is set the night on fire The time you hesitate is through The time you wallow in the mire The exhibition is built on the chronology of the works, in one word, based on the life of the artist. There are four parts, red monochromes, early works, secondly, fire paintings, thirdly, gold monochrome period, fourth, multi-layer monochromes, last period. Let us start with the first red monochromes, which started in 1958. Aubertin has chosen the red color for its properties. Blood, life, vitality. Red is used since the prehistory in the caves. Aubertin has experimented with many procedures to put red paint on a support. He first used a fork to maneuver a high quantity of paint. He also invented many structures, many ways to cover the support. With nails, wires, wood chips, wrapped paper, sponge toweling. Interesting series with nails are the Ivory Coast paintings, made on massive exotic wood board, where racks of red paint bring Aubertin in relation with the primitivism of African art. Yeah. 
the Amsterdam Zero exhibition of 1962 was the first exhibition in a museum of the European avant-garde. The most important artists were present. Mack, Pine, Uca, Klein, Armand, Fontana, Manzoni and the Dutch Nulgroep, Armando de Vries, Hendrikse, Peters and Schoonhoven. The fireworks started in 1961, four years after the red monochromes. The fire is the continuation of the red color. For Aubertin, fire is color and light. Aubertin also experimented with matches on different supports – aluminium, cardboard, wood, paper. The paintings of the gold period in 2003 can be considered as the plenitude period. The paintings here can be compared to a large symphony. The last room shows paintings built by different layers, placed one over the other. In these paintings, Bernard Aubertin wanted to forget the power of the red color. He wanted to give up the fight and to find peace in his life. The heavy weight of the black color will help him to find a way in the dialogue with the colors. Aubertin found his satisfaction in the white color. White is peace, silence, immateriality. And white will mute and close every artistic speech. The work Feu des Fins, Deceased Fire, can be considered as the testament of Bernard Aubertin. Last sequence of burning disc. Here you see... Frédéric Aubertin, the son of the artist who lights fire to the disc. Aubertin introduced the fire as an aesthetic element. He presented real flames and no more painted flames on a canvas as classical painters did. He placed the visitor directly in front of the fire as a performance. This was revolutionary in 1961, to show real physical elements, natural phenomena. That is the fundamental notion of the zero group. The turning fire disc where thousands of matches burn is an unforgettable moment. Baby, 